Hello YouTube, this is Hamzan6 on the Edge Project Media and today I will be showing you on how to speed up U-Torrent 3.3 Now, two years back I made an, uh, a video on how to speed up U-Torrent and today I will be bringing you another tutorial which is updated and might have better settings than the last video for uh, U-Torrent 3. Point something. Now, in this tutorial I will be clearing up what seeds and peers are because some of you do not know what seeds or peers are now seeds are basically people you are downloading from and peers are people who are downloading from you now that we have that clear we're going to begin with the process of speeding up uTorrent now click on options then preferences then click on connection and then go and look at the port now for the port you could choose whatever port you want and make sure that th there are a lot of people using the same port that you are using uh, the reason is that the more people using the port that you're using means the faster the download speed you get also to speed it up some more make sure you port forward the port now uh, I'm, I'll be Gi giving you guys a list of ports that you could use in the description of the video just in case if you want more speed or there's something wrong with the port that you're using in this video I'll be using 41447 <coughs> now go to bandwidth now on global upload rate limiting make, sh make uh, maximum upload rate 0 now here uh, it's your choice say that you want to limit the upload rate speed to 500 KB just in case if you want your download speed to be faster though this is useful if you're going to seed now at uh, global download rate limiting make sure maximum download rate is zero so that you can have an unlimited uh, download speed now for number of connections global maximum number of connections make it 128 maximum number of connected peers per torrent 64 number of upload slots per torrent 0 now go to uh, the torrent now all of this um, take them except for local limit to local peer bandwidth on protocol encryption outgoing must be set to enabled instead of disabled now go to queuing now maximum number of active torrents make it at 2 here it depends on you because what this does is let's say that you have 10 torrents all downloading at the same time having this option set to 2 will only download 2 torrents instead of 10 at the same time just so that you would have balanced download speed between the two now the setting is actually optional say that you want to put 10 or 5 or 20 it's all your choice now maximum number of active downloads one uh, minimum ratio 300 percent minimum seeding time zero minimum number of uh, available seeds zero now I might have m mistaken uh, maximum number of up active torrents for maximum number of active downloads so I'm not sure here so it's your choice um, advanced go there and at bt.allow underscore same underscore ip set that to true bt.connect underscore speed set that to 50 right down here 50 and then press on set now scroll down until you find <coughs> gi.show underscore no torrents underscore node set it to false and gi underscore update underscore rate to 2000 now scroll down some more until you reach peer dot disconnect underscore inactive or underscore interval 120 and last one rss dot update underscore interval set that 30 press on apply okay and enjoy having a really fast download speed now I hope you guys enjoy this video, please comment, rate and subscribe.